It makes you look moist. It makes you look good. <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna be doing like a really quick beat because I'm about to go out with a bae. We're gonna go on a cute little date. So I just wanted to do like my everyday kind of foundation routine and just makeup look because I've been doing this look a lot. This is my go-to like for when I want to look beat, but like still look natural, you know, because it's kind of like more of a natural glam. Um, I'm sorry if you can hear my fan in the background. It's really hot and I need the fan on. So I'm sorry. I'm gonna try to put some music over it so you can't really hear it. But I'm sorry if you can hear me, okay? CoverGirl did send me um, their latest PR package. Um, thank you, CoverGirl. This video isn't sponsored by CoverGirl and I'm not only gonna be using their products, but I did want to dip into this because this actually looks really cute. Like this is my kind of my kind of jam you know but for primer in the summertime um i've really been loving max fix plus primer this is the lavender scent so i just like to hydrate my skin before i put oh look at my deodorant <laughs> yeah i don't know what that was about but I'm also going to use the Full Spectrum CoverGirl Primer. This is a mattifying primer. I only use this in my T-zone area, um, especially when I know like I'm going to be outside. And I usually just get oily in my T-zone area. Like My nose gets kind of shiny and I have to blot it away. And then I've really been loving um, this Uma, Uma Beauty Foundation, the Say, Say What? Like, when I tell you this stuff is popping, I know when I first tried it on my channel, it was too dark for me and I wasn't really crazy about it. But now that I have a tan and it actually matches me better, I love this foundation. Like, everyone keeps stopping me and asking me like, what foundation are you wearing? And it's this one. I don't take the foundation all the way up on my forehead because my forehead is darker than the foundation. So I just cream contour up there and it matches fine. And then I'm gonna take my clean Sony Cash Expunge and I'm just gonna kinda like stipple over everything just to make sure that it's completely blended. So for the CoverGirl True Blend Concealers, this is giving me major like Tarte Shape Tape vibes, like the size of the concealer and just the packaging and everything. They gave me T100 Golden Amber T300, T300 Warm Honey and D100 Golden Caramel. I feel like, I don't think you guys can tell on camera it's because it's so bright in here, but I feel like I have darkness around my mouth that I like to color correct. So I like to take like a really kind of like cool toned. This is more olive -y. Just to like cancel out those areas. I don't know, it's been working for me lately. So I just put that there and it looks really weird, but just trust me. And then I put a little bit underneath my eyes because I feel like the darkness, like the darkness in my face just shows through. Then to actually like highlight and conceal, I think I'm gonna take Warm Honey T300. I'm gonna just lay that right on top here. The consistency of it is really creamy it's really nice let's see if it dries down super fast because i like to let my concealer sit a bit and then for cream contour i've been using my fenty matchstick of course this is hands down my favorite my forehead is sweating so it's gonna make products sticking there a bit <laughs> this looks so green on me oh my god Oh wow, okay, they're really matte. It doesn't, it doesn't, <laughs> it can't, it can't handle dry down time. It's too matte. Okay, it's fine. It's cool, it's cool, we don't roll with the punches. I'm gonna take a little bit of foundation in the back of my hand and I'm just gonna go over that area again. With the foundation. This concealer is super, super full coverage because once it dries down, like it literally does not budge. It's a matte finish. I feel very concealed. I'm gonna take a little bit of T100. This is the shade that I hadn't tried, Golden Amber. 
This one looks to have a bit more yellow in it and it's a bit brighter. And I'm just gonna put it right here. I'm not gonna let it sit for too long. I'm just going to blend it out. This concealer is so good. Wow, I'm really like full coverage. I'm gonna go in with the CoverGirl True Blend Minerals Banana Powder. Oh, it comes with a little powder puff. How cute. Yes, come on, drugstore banana powder. And I'm just gonna press that underneath my eye. Then I'm gonna take my Fenty Beauty Bronzer in Caramel Cutie. This one right here. And I'm just gonna bronze myself up. Then I'm gonna take Benefit's California Blush. It's like a peachy kind of coral. I'm just gonna put that on my cheeks. Smile. So you can hit the apple of your cheek. I'm gonna spray my face again with Fix Plus because I'm feeling very matte. Skin, baby. Let me do my highlight now. Pearl Crush, which is pretty light. And then there's Rose Quartz, also kind of light with a pinky tone. And then Gilded Glory, this one looks pretty. It's very soft, like the formula of it is very soft. Ooh. Yes, highlight, come on. Yes, cover girl. I'm gonna be shining, 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 you. Okay, so I just um, glued on some lashes, like I did mascara and false lashes, because typically if I'm going out, I'm wearing false lashes. I don't wear them every day, but I would definitely wear lashes if I was going out on a cute day. I want to take some selfies. I'm going to take a little bit of my bronzer. This is something you can do when you don't feel like doing a whole eye look. So I'm going to take some of my bronzer on a fluffy brush and just put it in my crease. Just like this. This is again my Fenty bronzer in Caramel Cutie. And I'm gonna take my Fenty highlighter in How Many Carrots. This is the Diamond, the Diamond Bomb highlighter. This in the sun literally looks like diamonds. It looks like diamonds on your skin. It looks like wet skin, like you just came out of the pool and your body is glistening for the gods. Yeah, that's what this highlighter looks like. So on camera, it's not really doing its thing, but in videos and photos in the sun, stop. So I'm just gonna take my finger and just tap some of this on my lid. I like to take a little bit on the tip of my nose. And then for my lips, I'm just gonna do a cork lip liner in a nude lip gloss. And then the gloss I'm gonna use is from Dose of Colors and Honey, I'm Home. And then just to add a little bit more shine, on top of that I'm gonna take the Fenty Gloss Balm in Diamond Milk. I put it on the back of my hand because I don't wanna dip the wand in the bottle and then put it on my lip and then put it back in the bottle. I just love nude. Uh. Gonna take a little bit of body lava and trophy wife from Fenty Beauty. And just gonna dress up the clavicle and you know the cleavage just a bit. I just feel like this is a summer must have. Smells so good too. Oh, it smells so good. It makes you look moist. It makes you look good. I want to look good. I want to feel good. I want to do good. Like, period. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. This is my completed, my go-to glam. Like, this is my go-to. 
This is the look that I always want to have on. This is the look that I feel the most beautiful in, that I feel the most confident in, that I feel the most bad bitchiest in. Like, this is that look, you know? I feel like everyone should have a look, the look, that look, and this is the look. <laughs> no, but seriously, like... <laughs> Let me know down below if you guys love this look as well. You can go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. Go ahead and click that subscribe button and join the fam because there will be new videos on the way. I love you guys. And don't forget, you are smart, you are beautiful, and people love you. I love you guys, and thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.